everybody, this is Beetle5, and welcome to another one of my reaction videos. Today, I have with me the Ginger here. Hello. And we will be reacting to Mewtwo vs. Shadow Death Battle. We have been thinking about this one, because, well, well, I have at least, because, honestly, yeah. this has been one of the few death battles as of late there. I'm having a really tough decision deciding who's going to win this fight. Yeah. I, I'm I'm edging more towards Shadow because while yes, they are both the ultimate life forms of their games, Shadow has much more chaotic power, like he has Chaos Blast, Chaos Control, Chaos Fear, and then Super Shadow, which I think gives him a huge advantage. While yes, Mewtwo does have his Mega Evolution, which I'm assuming they're gonna use Mega Evolution yeah. X. I think that's what yeah, the one they'll use, so. yeah. That does give him a huge edge as well. And he is telekinetic and all that stuff, but Shadow is slightly telekinetic as well, I think, if I recall. No, he, like... They no, can like, both teleport, I know that. Yeah, but, like, can they, uh, like, you see, you know, like, you know how, like, Shadow went up against, uh, Vegeta. Yes, and all but, but you know what, though, Vegeta outclassed Shadow so badly, and also, they didn't give him Chaos yeah, but, Blast but or like, Chaos Control, because like, I think he, at the time Vegeta vs. Shadow was made, the yeah. video game Shadow the Hedgehog for GameCube and PS2 wasn't out yet at that time, and that's when uh, he was first introduced to have the power of Chaos because Blast. I'm just thinking, if, if he can go against like Vegeta and like kind of almost win... He can at least go Well, the thing that stopped him in the fight against Vegeta was that he ran out of time with his super form, which it can still easily happen again because that's always yeah, happened. That's you true. you need a supply of rings to keep up your super form. That's how it is for Sonic and Shadow. But what they do in Death Battle, they just give it a bit of a time limit, which in sense, uh, it's the same thing, really. Yeah, that's true. All right. So uh, without further ado, then, let's begin this Death Battle in three, two, one, go. <laughs> Dun, dun, dun. With Death Battle, our combatants are always oh. extraordinary in one way or another, whether they're a superhero or a plumber. But these two are literally built to show up the rest of their kind. Mewtwo, oh, okay. <laughs> genetically engineered right. Pokemon, and Shadow the Hedgehog, the ultimate life form. He's Wiz and I'm Boomstick. And it's our job to analyze their weapons. I didn't ask you who do you think like is going to win this fight as of right now Death for pre-post really, analysis. I don't know. You know, now I'm, I'm aiming for Shadow right now for pre-post analysis. Ago, All right. a brilliant scientist oh, named the first Dr. Pokemon movie. I love the origin of the first Pokemon movie. Life form, which would change the world. Oh. That's great and all, but he had something else in mind. Fuji hoped his experiments would help him discover a way to resurrect Fuji. the person he cherished That's his name, the, the scientist's name. His deceased daughter, Amber. You can, I've only ever seen this online, because I've never seen it on the DVD. ball of consciousness. Because science! <laughs> but before he could finish, he had to create the most powerful Pokemon, a clone of the legendary Mew. And he named him Mewtwo. Yeah, Fuji wasn't very creative when it comes to naming, but when you can create a new life form with nothing but a fossilized eyelash, you know you're a master of genetic engineering. Of Damn. Course, I'd love to get more experience in myself. Don't you a thousand times, Wiz. You're not going to alter my DNA. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I would never do that. Always oh. watching, <laughs> Always. <laughs> Growing nice. up in a test tube, Mewtwo's only companions were Fuji's other test subjects, including Amber herself, through some sort of psychic link. Amber taught Mewtwo about the sun, the moon, tears, and, you know, life stuff. Oh, and also death when she died for good right in front of him. Worrying this may be too mentally traumatic for the still infant Mewtwo, Dr. Fuji's team erased all memory of her. Unfortunately, this left Mewtwo with a feeling of loss and confusion, and no memories to explain why. With nothing else to do, Mewtwo decided to take out all his aggression on all of humanity. And then he turned some stupid kid into stone, oh. a bunch of Pokemon cried. Hey, that scene was touching. Don't oh, you yeah, go mocking that scene, Boomstick. I cried at that, okay? Yeah, when I first I watched that movie, I cried. Shut up. Mind. Hey, wait a minute. You right? keep calling him it. Is Mewtwo a guy or girl? Well, neither. Technically, it's genderless. <laughs> oh. How does it bang? <laughs> it doesn't. <laughs> it doesn't. Well, one thing's for sure. It's got balls. Uh, I always wonder that! Oh, Why the hell he has balls at the end of his fucking heels? That baffled the shit out of me! Ability for when those shields don't quite cut it. <laughs> Alongside its other abilities, Mewtwo's favorite move is Psychic. A powerful form of telekinesis. Which literally With just it, stops everything dead in its tracks. As heavy oh, what? Uh. 500 pound onyx flying through the air. Uh. He can even make himself fly like a Zubat out of hell. 
Oh, like a Zubat. Melee oh, Poké yeah. Tournament. Yeah. Or occasionally a massive uh, spoon. Massive Would you what? Say he sometimes spoons oh, shit! He killed Deoxys with a spoon? Especially when it uses Hyper Beam or Psy Strike. Attacks so strong they can incapacitate the toughest of Pokemon in a single hit. And when trouble comes a knocking, Mewtwo answers the door. Oh, with a God. Was this, was this, was this, um, yep, the Genesect movie? The few Pokemon Ugh, capable of gross. Mega evolving without the assistance of a trainer. As Mega Mewtwo Y, it gains enormous. Oh, oh, oh Mewtwo, I was wrong. It's not X, it's Y. Mewtwo ah. powerful enough to fly I like into better. space while carrying a robot bug monster. Genesect. Fast enough to breach escape velocity over 25,000 miles per hour, okay. over 32 times the speed of sound. So, really, really fast. Mewtwo is so skilled in its psychic prowess, it can wipe specific memories from dozens of people at once. On top of all that, it can survive a massive amount of abuse. Like the time it got double impaled by an alien Pokemon's tentacle. Oh, oh. man. That, I would love to find a comic where Mewtwo fights Deoxys. Yeah. That's an awesome fight. Including a legendary Articuno. It also teleported an entire crater lake from the top of Mount Kena. This lake is comparable to a similar body of water in the real world, Lake Kilatoa, which holds over 385 million tons Holy of water. Holy shit. Wow, that's almost enough power to lift my ex-wife on buffet day. <laughs> Being a psychic Pokemon, Mewtwo is naturally weak to bug, ghost, and dark-type damage. Strange Dr. Fuji didn't pull that code out of his DNA, but whatever. Hey, yeah, that's you true. gotta have some sort of failsafe when you're making the worst Shadow definitely has dark Pokemon. powers. Uh, ah, yeah. yes, the ultimate failsafe against the most powerful psychic Pokemon. Bugs! Oh, God, <laughs> oh come on! God, if it was adorable! I was not born of Pokemon. I was created, and my creators have used and betrayed me. So, I stand alone! I forgot how good that the scene was. So, so fucking A. I can't. I, I'm going to watch the first movie yeah, again. I, go I have it right here. Wait. I got it right here on DVD. Years ago, I a brilliant nice. scientist love this named movie. Professor Gerald Robotnik, the grandfather of Sonic's forever balding nemesis, worked to create a new life form which would change the world. It was called. Project Shadow, a covert government operation to discover the secret to immortality. I have to watch Sonic X again, too. I haven't seen Sonic X in a long time. In Professor Gerald's case, specifically for his granddaughter, Maria, who was dying as a result of neuroimmune deficiency syndrome. Now that I think about it, Project Shadow is a pretty scary name for a program that's all about curing diseases and saving humanity. Maybe it has something to do with the program's secret pack Black with a Doom. Hive Mayan alien race called the Black Arms. Still one of my favorite Sonic Perhaps. games ever. Okay. So what do you get when you take immortality, the cure of all diseases, <laughs> and the aliens, and <laughs> the put them power all together to make the ultimate life form? Nice. You get a hedgehog. Shadow the Hedgehog was the first step toward a perfect future. And during his time in Gerald's space laboratory, Shadow and Maria grew very close. Until they were separated by a bullet. Turns out the governments of the world weren't too fond of Officially all likes business, nothing. So they stormed the That's place, depressing. <laughs> Shadow and killed Maria right in front of oh, him. Fifty years later, Shadow escaped and decided to take his You don't know the story of Shadow? Just killing everyone. No, I never watched Until he remembered Maria's last words. I never watched Shadow or played. So, you never watched Sonic, Sonic X or you ever played the now, so on Shadow the side game? Of good, Shadow no. dedicated wow. himself right. to protecting the world from the forces of evil. Turns out fighting the bad guys isn't too hard when you've got super strength, super speed, helped along by some awesome rocket shoes, and a bucket of deadly chaos powers. By channeling the potentially unlimited power of the Chaos Emeralds, Shadow can enhance physical attacks, heal- There we go, Chaos Control, Chaos Sphere, Chaos Blast, Sphere of Life, and Shadow and Heal. With the power All of his Chaos, chaos powers. Control, he yeah. can warp through space and distort time. Yeah, you slowing go. it down to a crawl. So he can both distort time. Exactly, he can speed through it and stop it. so much power, okay. he can only contain it all with two inhibitor rings yeah. around Yeah, and if those are removed, he like releases a shitload of power. Chaos Emeralds. Which he can use to transform into a Super Saiyan Shadow. <laughs> as Super Shadow, he is completely invulnerable, can move at the speed of light, and has unlimited access to the power of the Chaos Emeralds. Enough power to stop the Space Colony Arc's collision with Earth, and to teleport a giant comet the size of a city. Assuming this rock is half hollow, and using the density of concrete as minimum base, this black comet must it's weigh not said what the black comet's made of. 15 million tons. Even without his super form, Shadow is powerful enough to wipe out an entire alien fleet in one blast. Fast enough to reach hypersonic speeds, 
and strong enough to play tug of war with a giant space monster who is so big he uses a planet a tenth the size of our moon. Defeated as a Devil Do Black Death Metal Sonic Solars and power. Final Hazard. Probably wow, dead. that's like all yeah, of any game he's ever been in. <laughs> in his abilities. Also, he has a terrible memory. This guy has been most of his oh, life God, wondering he, who the, the hell yeah, he is. The whole and memory system of a shadow is like way out there. Up losing his memories later anyway. To be fair, if I fell from outer space and all I lost were my memories, I'd consider it a really good day. I mean, I lose them from just falling over at the bar. <laughs> 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 we can't forget that the super shadow form only lasts so long. Yes. Then again, yeah. when you move at light speed and have control silver. of the time, who cares? Sorry, but silver should have fought Mewtwo. Would have been a better opponent. Life form. Many years ago, Professor Gerald Robotnik endowed me with the power of chaos control. A normal creature like yourself doesn't stand a chance against me. <sighs> Still a all shadow right, here. I feel like Shadow's got so much Let's more power. Yeah. Once and for all. It's if you two can last, last I'm not, I'm not gonna be disappointed if he does lose. He's I love both of them. I just really think Shadow's gonna win this fight. Yeah, I think Shadow also. Skitty! Ah. <laughs> like, oh, he's in the Pokemon world. Okay. That's cool. Oh yeah, Mewtwo is always in the cave. And you ever play Pokemon X and Y? He's always in the cave. Oh, Whoa! Yeah. Holy fuck! Those eyes. Those are weird. Chaos Emerald. Oh, right. Zubats. <laughs> Goddamn Zubats. <laughs> oh, boy. You are not welcome here. Whoa. Leave this place. What's your problem, freak? Whoa! I know not its name, <laughs> but it is black, red, and very annoying. <laughs> what is with Shadow's voice? Yeah. That sounds stupid. Mewtwo's voice sounds more badass than Shadow. <laughs> Here we go. Whoa. Oh, wow. Spin dash, come on. <laughs> oh, he got the fucking food. <laughs> oh, this God. Stop you. Another gem? What's he doing? Chaos. I must know. Oh. Ooh, okay. okay. No. Me memory no. read. As far as I know, Mewtwo has no way to escape time. <laughs> yeah. Listen, he'll take the hit. Uh. Wow, that was fast. Yeah, why is he using this? So yeah, late? I'm like, unless Mewtwo's gonna go Mech Evolution. <laughs> Good try, monster. But you're done. Chaos Blast. Too much. Whoa. Okay. Oh, here we go. Now oh, I want Mega Evolution. Okay. Yeah. Ooh. Chaos. Not this time. Uh, the time. Control. Yeah. Uh, uh. What just happened? Maria. Wait. Where am I? What? Oh my God! I'm glowing. Why uh, am I glowing? What? What? Sayonara. Oh! Did he erase his memories? Oh! Oh! Oh shit! When we started death battle, I don't think we ever expected to see someone die by spoon. <laughs> yeah. Holy Shadow crap! Had the advantage in pure speed and oh, that's so cool. This time, Rain defeated Brawl. <sighs> Again. I don't know why. Oh, shush, 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 wait, shush. Giving it the knowledge it needed to counter or avoid crazy powers like chaos control. Ultimately, there was nothing really stopping Mewtwo from just taking over Shadow's mind, and its impressive durability and healing power bought it enough time to do so. Pretty hard to win a fight when your opponent can make you forget what you're doing and who you are in an instant. Okay, that's Shadow what he did. mind control before, and has always relied on outside help to recover. Even while Super Shadow was physically invulnerable, this form didn't protect his mind. Like that time he fell from space, and then the worst game ever happened. <laughs> yeah, Shut up! I, gonna lose. I like that game. The winner is Mewtwo. Okay, seems <laughs> fair. That was a hell of a fight. Oh boy, what's it gonna be? Red versus blue! Tax! It's Tax! It's Tax! Please be Tex! Red versus blue! You ever wonder who'd win in a fight between Carolina?
Carolina! Oh! No, only hopeless nerds on the internet care about that kind of thing. Uh, yeah. Why do you think I'm asking you? Oh! Carolina versus the Meta! Holy crap! That is awesome! That is so sick! And next time on Death Battle, we've got something very special planned. So stay tuned, we'll be announcing it shortly. Oh, I'm so excited. In the meantime, you guys can watch a show that Brian and I work on called Who Is? It's tons of information about characters. <gasps> Dude, about I've been, been putting in for somebody from Red vs. Blue forever! Members can always watch Death Battle I was thinking, it's it's got, you gotta put either Tex early. or put Carolina in it! Yeah. Oh, man! Oh, I can't wait. Actually, get a 30-day free trial by clicking the link, so do it! You guys but wait, is she fighting the meta? Yeah. But th this will be the very first step out where they're from the same thing. That seems kind of weird. I'm not sure what to think of that, but holy crap! You know, I don't know if it's not the meta. I feel like they some could, could come up with a better opponent for her. But regardless, Carolina will so win this next fight. Fucking a. Oh man, that was so awesome. It's so, weird because like for the the shadow versus uh Sonic, you too. I knew it when he used it too early. I knew he was he lost it. Yeah, that's <laughs> so I was thinking of like he used it that soon. I'm like I'm thinking he's done. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, that's about all the time we got to today. So thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button to leave a comment of what else I should do in the future. And I will see you guys next time. Later. Laters.